Okay guys, what we're going to do here is make a uh, improvised compass. Uh, you see my compass here? Alright, uh, of course you have your north-south line there. And what I've done is I have a basin of any type um, with water in it. Uh, could be natural, could be a stump of some sort with water in it. And I have a, a bottle cap that floats. All right, this can be a leaf or anything that floats on top of the water. I also have just a regular needle, sewing type needle. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this needle and I'm actually rubbing it in my hair. Rubbing it in my hair, all right? Make sure you rub this needle in your hair the same direction every time. If you rub it back and forth, you're not gonna charge it correctly. All right, you can also rub it over your clothes but I found that uh, rubbing it in my hair works a whole lot better. All right, make sure your bottle cap, see how my bottle cap has gone to the, uh, the edge right there? All right, it won't spin properly, so it needs to be brought back to the center. It needs to be brought back to the center, just like that there. All right, my needle is done rubbing my needle in my hair, and I'm gonna take that ne this needle, and I'm gonna bounce it obviously opposite of the way my compass was facing and let's take a look and see what it does watch it spin and stop all right north south line just like that and that is a improvised compass all right we'll do it again just to show you Rubbing the needle in my hair again, bringing my bottle cap to the center. All right, once again, obviously putting the needle on the bottle cap the opposite direction of north and south. And it turns, pointing north and south. And that is an improvised compass. Thank you very much.